He's fine, you know. Um, I don't have full flex on it, but it doesn't hurt like it used to when I'm walking around, so it's good. Coach, uh, another sweep. You talked about playing your best ball this time of year. So what does it mean to sweep this series? Yeah, it's tough to sweep anybody. And, uh, you know, Memphis, you know, coming off a sweep of South Florida last weekend, I think they had one five in a row coming in. So they were playing good baseball. Uh, I just thought today we set the tone offensively. Um, even in the first inning, we got first and second. J-Dub gets the button down sack fly just to get that momentum. And we scored four straight innings. I mean, it just makes it really hard on the other team. Amac, a great day for him. I know he's done it defensively all year, but what's it like to see him swinging the bat better? Yeah, it's in there. You know, when he tries to do too much, he's jumping, he chases out of the zone. I thought he did a really good job today of like swinging the pitches that were strikes, and he got some good swings off. Talk about the bullpen's performance today. Yeah, Danny Bill was great, got us out of a jam. Uh, Landon Ginn was great. Um, and then we, you know, put some guys in, hadn't pitched a whole lot, and, uh, you know, didn't necessarily go our way. Uh, we threw a ball in the center field, but um, I'm glad we scored 11 runs and we won the game, so that's all we're looking to do. Match up at Campbell on Tuesday, very important, obviously. Yeah, very important. Yeah, all the games are important, so no, no disrespect to them, but uh, they're all important. So it's the last guaranteed home game. I hope the fans come out and make it a really good home for the fans. How's Starlin's back doing right now? Uh, not as good today as it was yesterday. So uh, he's day to day. Uh, that's why he didn't play at Old Dominion. He gutted it out, you know, Friday and Saturday. And that's the reason he came out of the game late yesterday. Just got worse as the game went on. This being such a special weekend, how does it feel for the guys to play so well? Yeah, you know, I told the media yesterday that, you know, yesterday especially is like the most nervous game for me of the year because I want our guys to play well for the seniors. And what they've meant to us. Um, at East Carolina University. They've won a lot of baseball games, but they've also got degrees and just represented our program with very, very high. Well, when you look at the field on a Sunday like this with all these families out here, that really speaks to kind of the bigger picture of what you've built here at this program. Yeah, you know, it's it's a village. It takes a village to build a program like we have, and um, we just want to stay consistent, and the consistency that we've had is probably the thing that makes me the most proud is, you know, we just haven't been a one-hit wonder, um, but the community just gets behind us, and our guys to these kids are like Major League Baseball players, and um, it's just really special. Those three mothers of those seniors showed some athleticism. They today. did. I told Spivey <laughs> that uh, his mom, uh, way more athletic than he is, and uh, Allison was actually, uh, I think she was an academic All-American at William & Mary as a gymnast, so she showed it off today. And then, um, you know, Hoove's mom as well. She might be more athletic than Hoove. Jungle so. jump. Yeah, yeah, jungle jump. <laughs> did you see the uh, catch by Barini's dad? At the, uh, I did not. I did not. <laughs> sure did. Yeah. You talk about consistency. How do you establish that? Just, yeah, how do you establish that? You just talk to about the guys about showing up every day, and really that's about life for me. The people that show up every day and are just consistent, those are the ones that have the most success, and that's what we want to ask you. Obviously, Mother's Day coming out here, we already talked about that, but the family aspect of this, whether that was five or six years ago, recruiting them to now, how nice is it to be able to get to know these moms and these families? And of course, the year, how hard is it now for those three guys and their families to end this coming kind of year? Well, you know, I hope the end's not coming here. We still got a lot of baseball players in my mind, so we just want to keep getting better. But I want to say Happy Mother's Day to all the moms out there, especially the moms of our players who've done such a great job raising really quality young men, and also Happy Mother's Day to my mom. So I'll have get to have dinner, and I'll be happy since we won. So I know she's happy we won today.